Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And tonight's little video is going to be about adding a little flair to a name tag to put an engraved board around it, kind of add some accent, but still be able to cut it out. So you've got this shape, and, and if you did not see my other video that I just posted a little earlier about how to get your nodes connected, please watch that one. It's, it's pretty neat. So I took this same shape and I thought, you know, that would make a pretty nice name tag. It would be a little different. So you've got a cut line. And if you watch my other videos, you know I like to draw in the center of the page. And, and this one's in the center of the page. You just press P on the keyboard and it's going to put it in the center of the page. But we want to put this engravable line. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go up to Effects, down to Contour. I'm going to contour it two steps to the inside. Then I'm going to hit apply. And you've got these two lines. Go up to arrange, break contour group apart. Now just to make sure this works, I'm going to take my hairline and I'm going to get it out of the way. Now I'm going to take my color fill tool and I'm going to color fill that. Now I'm going to get out of, get out of the way. Now I'm going to erase my contour lines because they could be hairlines and they could cause you trouble later. So now you just select that, P on your keyboard, because this has no uh, cut lines in it now, so it's gonna engrave. And that might be a little bit offset too much, but I think it would look good. And just grab your name, put it in the center of the page or whatever you're doing. And, and this name tag would be pretty neat because it, it would kind of stand out and you could maybe have a graphic or a clip art in the top or the bottom. So that's real easy to do and I I thought I'd draw one up tonight. Hope that helped a little bit and thank you for watching.